hello welcome to my channel my name is alicia today i have a wantable some of you guys may be like why do you have a wantable uh you didn't like them last time i have not had good luck it was an impulse purchase it might have been a silly impulse purchase i literally chose to order this like the day before we left on our alaskan cruise which is silly because of you're gonna eat a ton um i've gained weight from the cruise but like this is the second day back from the cruise, so I don't think it's necessarily, I probably a bunch of water weight. I don't know. So it probably was very silly ordering a box before I went on a cruise. The other thing for Wantable is that they normally, for me, take about three weeks to get me a box, at least a solid two. Um, normally I place the order. I will say for me, generally, it's a full week before they even tell me it's shipped, sometimes more this was like shipped the next day so of course it came in the middle of our trip um it always does take about a week for shipping i don't know it comes from i believe wisconsin to california um i don't know <laughs> i may need to shut the door but anyway we will see i the reason i kind of caved is there was a bunch of stuff i liked they have a, i forget what it's called but you can basically request things there were a ton of things I liked and I requested. So fingers crossed that I liked them, they fit, they sent them. I also need work clothes. Um, I had gained weight, but I feel like I gained weight differently this time. And so my legs didn't really get bigger from here. My, my chest up didn't really get that much bigger, but my stomach is quite a bit bigger, which is making fitting it's, it's making things difficult because a 2x sometimes fits in my stomach but then it's too big up here sometimes it doesn't even fit my stomach so I don't know I'm a little like in between and I'm not sure what to do about it um also if you're interested in seeing pictures from Alaska I will link the video I just posted um there there are tips for cruising but if you just were interested in seeing the pictures or videos uh from alaska i will put that there but anyway i have not opened this i really just put this uh rip this open now because i kind of wanted to do first impressions with you guys um so i've had this box for a whole day um i had i was home yesterday but i just we were too busy getting things uh situated from being on a trip the colors look good so oh this is looking really good i am super excited um i'm not sure how much you can tell from that but that is the tops they there's white i wanted white pants although i feel like they're not in but i really like white pants that used to be a staple oh my gosh i am so excited i know the last time i got one of them they did i didn't keep anything they didn't um really listen this oh i'm excited i love the colors i see um so let's see they always give you the mailer um let's see my stylist is Alyssa. if i kept everything which i doubt i would because they give you seven items it would be 355 dollars um prices look fairly good um the most expensive is a hundred which is liverpool which is understandable and the cheapest is 35. so let's go ahead and it looks like three of my requests came in it looks like we have i think jewelry it comes in this little pouch and it, look, I feel, it feels like a box i thought first i thought maybe it was a wallet because it felt kind of square um so these are arch earrings and gold $35 by Lou and co I will say um a box or two prior I had kept a ring which I loved but the gold plating came off like that I will admit that I what wore it in the shower all of that but um I would not have expected it to um come off the way it did but it's only on the bottom part so it doesn't really bother me these are actually really cute. Those are really unique. I love the kind of shade of gold, how it's shimmery. Um, I really like these. I will say prior to COVID, I loved the big earring and I have still have a whole collection of big earrings. I generally now am into like a hoop, a stud, 
I don't often wear big dangles, but honestly, I think these are really cute. Um, and I really like these. I think I'm going to try these on to see how they go. Um, for whatever reason, these are really calling my name. I really, I really like those. Um, now if I like a bunch of clothes, I'm not sure I would get them just because it adds up. All right. So the first top, maybe not so exciting, but it's gray. Um, but otherwise I am loving the colors I see here. This is by Chris and Carol. This is a brand that I believe kind of used to come in fashion, um, made in the USA. This is a 2X, um, and this is $42, honestly. And I know I've seen some other um, Wantable unboxes. This is a very plain tank. Um, it is soft. I will say the fabric, I mean, it's not thin, but it's not thick. So I don't know. Again, it's made in the USA. So I think you have to take that with a grain of salt. You're paying more because it's made in the USA. So I don't know what use I have for this. It is a dark gray, which is okay. Uh, light grays are a no-go. Grays in general, though, aren't my favorite color. Um, so we will see how it fits, but I don't really have a use for a $42 gray tank. Um, but we will see. It looks like it will be flowy and have no problem fitting. I love the colors and the pattern. Now this is West K. So maybe that's different than West Key. I feel like they used to have West Key a lot in this and West Key runs really small. So this must be different. This is West K. Um, 2X, $58. I'm a little afraid. I'm hoping it fits. Um, but it is polyester. So there is no stretch. And I am going to go out on a limb and say it is not going to fit. It doesn't seem like a true 2X, but I love the colors on here. Um, I love this. It has a tie on the side. I think it's the side. So it is kind of a, does a crisscross and then it ties on the side. I would love this. This would look great with the white pants they sent. I just don't think it's going to fit. Um, and I will also say, I feel like this doesn't feel like a 2X. Um, but anyway, I am i don't think it's going to fit. But we will see. Maybe I'll be surprised. But I love it. I think they've nailed my style, except for maybe that gray tee. Um, this is $58. Yeah. Um, they're saying, I guess, teal, yellow. Yeah. Anyway, I love this. Sadly, I don't think it's going to fit. We will see. Maybe I could size up. Um, I love the colors on this too. It is a dress. Um, love the colors. And so this dress is $78. Love a Pella. Um, I'm hoping the straps and everything up here are school appropriate because I really need some kind of like, you know, not statement, but kind of statement pieces for the first week of school. And I do think it would be okay. Um, I think as long as that's not too low cut. Um, I love the colors. So we will see how it looks on. I will say this also doesn't look overly big. Like this is the waist piece. So I don't know. I don't know whether like their two X's are running small but I, I love this. This has the potential to be a great piece. I will say $78 is kind of pricey. Um, so this next one is a green top and I love, oh, it's a tank. Oh, that's a bummer. So I don't, oh, this is a bummer. This is, um, uh, I love the green. I love the polka dots. I don't like spaghetti straps. I don't wear spaghetti straps. Um, so this is my skies are blue. I, yeah, I think I need to start adding stretchy fabrics. Um, scalloped neck dot cami in green. It's a two X skies are blue, $54. Um, it is double lined. It does seem short. Like, I mean, this kind of seems cropped to me and I don't do cropped. Um, I do like the scalloped edge. We will see. I don't currently have a blazer or anything to wear with it. 
Um, I love the green. I love the polka dots. I love how the tops here would really go well with their, um, the white pants. But for me, this is a specialty bra thing. I don't do specialty bra. I would, I just don't wear spaghetti straps in public. Uh, it, I don't know. There's nothing wrong with it. I just don't like it. And so I couldn't wear this to work like this. Um, right now it's like 98, so I don't want to put a cardigan. Um, so I'm bummed that that spaghetti strap, I don't know. I almost feel like I need to type up in Word like a whole list of things. Um, and then just always copy and paste it. All right. I'm hoping these work. I hope they're high rise. I would keep these in a heartbeat if they fit and look good. Um, they are white capris. Um, they are Liverpool, which generally fits really well, but I've been having fit issues and quality issues with them. Um, they've kind of gotten into the low rise trend. So I'm hoping once a listen that these are high rise. These are their pull on stretch. Um, I hope they fit, um, they look high rise. These would definitely be a great thing for work. Although I really feel like, am I crazy? But I kind of feel like white is out, which I'm not sure I care about, but I have not seen many like white pants. Oh, I hope these fit. I'm excited about these. I will say Liverpool, um, the pair of jeans I bought, like they had like the little hem turned up. I really should have like reached out to customer service, but I didn't. Um, so I'm hoping these are good. And then we have some shorts, um, which if they fit, I could kind of use, but they are button up and I'm not sure. I'm not, I feel like these are too long and I feel like I'm not into button up. Um, what brand is this? Let's see. High rise cuff Bermuda 16 W can can, um, I've not heard of the brand Can Can. Um, they are stretchy. I've never owned button up like this. So in my in my mind, it seems like a hassle to be unbuttoning and buttoning. Um, but maybe not. These are also really long. Um, I do like kind of a seven inch inseam. I would say this is like a 12 inch, a 10 inch, something really long. Um, and this actually rolls down. So it would be even longer. We'll see. These might look awesome. I don't know. Um, they really nailed my style. I will say that for the most part, I'm a little afraid about some of the fit. Um, but anyway, let's get to the best part, which is the try on. All right. I have the first piece back on, which I think sadly has to be a no. Um, it definitely fits here up. Um, I do love the colors. I'm not sure the print is the best. Um, I will notice that I feel like this year things aren't flowy. Um, that's happened to me with stitch fix, etc. I don't think I could size up cause this is fairly loose. Like I would have to, um, get a little snap put in or something. Um, but this goes straight down and it just, to me, accentuates lumps and bumps. Um, I don't even know, honestly, if a 3X would help because it just goes straight down. I wish um, things kind of were cut better. Um, I did leave my shorts on, so I'm sure that's adding a little um, bit to it. Um, I may need to put my shapewear on. I always wear shapewear under more for modesty in case anything were to happen with, you know, I don't know. I mean, with a long dress, there's really nothing too much that would happen at school, but I always wear shapewear. So maybe I need to try it on with shapewear. Um, but I don't know. Um, this is definitely one I need your feedback on. Does it look really good? Is the pattern too distracting? I don't think the colors come out as much, um, but I do love the colors. Um, I just know looking in the mirror, I don't like seeing all the lumps and bumps, but, um, that might get better with the shapewear. But this definitely isn't too tight. It's kind of loose. I mean, loose is not really the right word, but there's, I, if I sized up, this would be really too big. Um, so I don't know. I'm going to have to, I don't know. I'm going to have to try it on with shapewear, I think. So I did 
I did put on the shapewear, but I'm thinking this is just a no-go. It does look better with the shapewear. Um, but I just, I don't like that from here down, it's literally just straight. I wish it came out and had a little more fabric. Also in the mirror, um, I see kind of cleavage and I just don't like that. I think if I did kind of put a little fabric glue and glue it up here, it would be fine for school. But as it is, I think it shows a little too much and I don't like that for school if you're bending over helping kids. Um, I really had high hope. I love the colors for this, but I don't <clears throat> think it's a win. Um, I don't know. I would love your opinion. I do think in the last couple clothing boxes I've gotten, I'm being hard on myself because I don't like my stomach. Um, and that seems to be where all my weight's gone. Um, so does this look good? Is this a keeper? Am I being too hard on myself? Please let me know. Um, but right now my gut reaction <clears throat> is I don't love it, especially $78 worth. Um, so let me know. Um, and I'll be back with the other items. All right, I am back with the next two pieces. They are a no. Um, I didn't like Chris and Carol really back when they were in fashion because they're too long. And so this is just a standard tank. It's too long for me. Um, I also have the Can Can pants on. Um, they don't button the top two, but they do fit everywhere else. To me, these are the awkward length. I think I don't like them being knee length. I would rather them be capri or actual shorts. Um, again, I can't button them up all the way, so they really don't fit. Um, but that's always been my problem. It's just become more extreme. Um, being pregnant didn't help. And then gaining the last little bit. My stomach is just much bigger than my legs. So these fit my legs, but they don't fit um, my waist. And again, I don't like the length. So these two are definitely a no, which I kind of anticipated anyway. All right, I am back with three pieces. I will say I love these earrings. Um, they may have to stay. To me, they're unique. Um, I might feel like these would be my favorite earrings for like the next quarter. Um, like I think it was last year or the year before I got those paper clip earrings from oh anyway that joy subscription I loved those and wore them so often I don't know I just feel like these really just make me happy I mean I don't know that seems really silly but I really like them I like how um the three bands kind of make this like horseshoe or circle or um rainbow and I just kind of like how I don't know, flashy? Flashy is not the right word. I'm at a loss for words. Anyway, I really like them. I really think these earrings are keepers. Um, <clears throat> so this Skyzer Blue Tank, number one, I will say it's good quality. I do like the scalloping. I like that really, you can really almost just wear a regular bra, at least in the front. I haven't seen in the back because it really kind of, because it comes so high up, it does a good job of covering it. I will say um, this top to me reads more business like you would put a blazer on it. Um, I will say because the fabric does not stretch I think when I sit down it would be too tight um, but it does um, at least fit while I'm standing up. So in the back you can definitely see the bra too much for my liking. Um, so I don't know. And then I have the Liverpool pants on, which technically fit. I, I, this is where I wish places could send you, um, two sizes, especially like in pants. Technically I put them on. The band is really tight and kind of like rolls here. You can't see that under the shirt. They do fit just fine. Like as far as the butt goes. So I feel like if I sized up to an 18W, I would be baggy right here. But I also feel like white pants kind of stretch and like show lumps and bumps. So I'm not sure that they're not too tight here. 
I would really love your opinion. I really need some help. Um, so right here in the stomach, I feel like an 18 would be better. Um, <clears throat> but like I said, I'm fairly sure the 18 would then be baggy in the butt. Um, they had them like one rolled and one down. So I don't know. Um, is there a way that looks better? So I don't know. I really don't think this top is a winner. Um, if I had a navy blue blazer, I think this would be really nice. I don't, but let me go get a cardigan. All right, it pains me to have this cardigan on. I mean, it's gonna be well into the upper 90s today. I really do like that. <clears throat> I, I really do. Um, I will say when I sit sat down, this does get tight across my stomach. Um, so I think this is cute. Um, I like this outfit. Um, but we're at least three to four months before I could even wear a cardigan. Um, we just now started our, our summer. May was almost cold. I was looking for my price sheet. So I don't know. I do love the concept of this shell. If it had sleeves, I would consider it. Um, but... I don't know. I'd have to dig out my, I did have some lightweight um, blazers, but they really don't fit since I've gained the weight. Um, I don't know. I do think this is cute. Let me know, but I'm thinking it is a pass. But these earrings I feel like are um, keepers. I don't know. They're unique and I really like them. And I really need your help. Is this size okay? um in my legs here um because i really think the white pants would be good for work um it's just size up or keep this all right i have one more top so i will be back all right this shirt is to me probably more of a 1x extra large i really don't even want to stand back I love the colors. I love the V-neck. If this fit, it would probably be a keeper, although I feel like it's very short. Um, there, no way would a 3X make this any better, but it is just totally too tight, too short. You can kind of see the white pants. Um, the waistband doesn't quite go up where it should. Um, so clearly this is just a no-go. But you get a better look at the pants on whether I should keep them this size or size up. Um, I wish, I feel like from Onesable, I expect them to know their sizes better. Um, from Nadine West, Fashion, I sort of get it's cheap, it's fast, whatever. But I wish they would know that this brand runs small. So then they should um, give you the next size up. I also kind of wish for a company like Wantable with the prices of Wantable that they would carry more true to size. Um, but I don't know. Anyway, this top could have been a keeper. I love the colors, but it clearly doesn't fit. So right now the earrings for me are clear winners. I really, I really like them and they don't actually bother me the way that they lay and they're very lightweight. So these winner, the winners are here. I would love your feedback <clears throat> on the other pieces, specifically the dress, only on the dress and the green shirt and the white pants. Um, keep, size up, whatever. Anyway, um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day.